Fuck, I have to... Ugh. Okay, it appears that even from here, backing out will not automatically put me over here. Only pressing left will. I really should have practiced this. Okay, the person in charge of this op. Snake, why are you sitting like that? Put Colonel, some pants on, man. who are you speaking man. for? Naturally, I'm representing the U.S. government. Can you tell me what this so light, who's light in is supervisory behind? control of this operation? The President of the United States. Huh. Which means that the President must be meeting with his top aides in the map room about now, huh? No, at this point they're still video conferencing with each other. MSN? If that's a real nuclear warhead, shouldn't they issue a COG? Not yet. The Secretary of Defense has operational control and is fully aware of the situation. Huh. After you infiltrate, if you determine they possess nuclear launch capabilities, a COG will be issued. Well, if they haven't relocated to the nuclear shelter under Mount Washington, I suppose there isn't that much reason to worry yet. Is the National Security Agency in on this? Yes. So is the DIA, the Defense Intelligence Agency. The DIA? I'm starting to get a bad feeling about this. They'll be sending us some support. We don't need I you, death I jockeys. They said, uh, we they need a nuclear weapons specialist. Support. Of course. A nuclear weapons specialist has already been assigned to us. You're just gonna end it right there? <laughs> couldn't, it, couldn't you just to fit it in? The support crew, I guess. And they had to put it into their own thing. I guess I can't talk considering I have all my videos. <laughs> a couple of my videos. We need backup separated. from a specialist. I'm just an amateur when it comes to nuclear weapons. I know. That's why I've requested the assistance of a military cool, analyst they, named they Nastasha Romanenko. Sort of, uh, had She'll be providing you backup uh, by codec. Just a female analyst? On the video, and I think it looks She's really cool. built up an impressive record as an advisor for the nuclear emergency search team. Contact her if you have any questions. She's also an expert on high-tech weapons. Where's she working from? At her home in Los Angeles. Just like I am. California. Seems like a million miles away. I think that's actually a better line. Ah, and, uh... And, uh, Nastasha will be sort of doing a little... Something kind of uh, interesting in my walkthrough. I'm not going to be calling her in my actual walkthrough, but I'll be doing some extra stuff with her. Colonel, you're retired. Why are you involved in this? Because there aren't many people who know Foxhound as well as I do. Is that really the only reason? I've been soldiering Is for a right long time. Front of Snake or something? I don't know anything else. I guess even though I'm getting a little old, I still love to be in the field. Colonel, you're a lousy liar. Hmm. Tell me Maybe the real reason. Time. I don't know. Okay, Snake. Sorry. I'll be frank. Oh, a person okay. very dear to me done. is being held hostage. Who is it? My niece, Meryl. I've actually never met anyone by the name of Meryl. And for a while, I didn't meet anyone by the name of Naomi. Hell, I never met anyone with the name Roy. What was your niece doing here? Several soldiers here. were she reported missing the, the day of the revolt. And my niece was one of those called in as an emergency replacement. She looks like you. She's my little brother's girl. 18? He died wow. in the Gulf War. Really Since then, that. I've been watching after her. A personal motive, Colonel. That's not very soldierly. Not very I'm retired. I'm just an old man now. And I'm your friend. Since when are we friends? I've, I've thought of us as friends card. since the fall of Zanzibar. With my personality, I don't have too many friends. That's wow, what I trust wow, about you. Wow, it's what makes you human. More human. Please, Snake. Save my niece, Meryl. All right. But I have two conditions. Name them. One, no more secrets between us. I want complete disclosure at all times. And two, I'll only accept orders directly from you, Colonel. No cutoffs involved, okay? Agreed. Hmm. That's why I was called. Making but that entire thing, statement what? entirely pointless. I'm not a colonel anymore. Just a retired old warhorse. I understand. And for the whole series, you colonel. just called him colonel anyway. Like right there. 
Ignore his, ignore his will, and it shall be done somehow. That doctor, is she part of this operation too? She was in charge of Foxhound's gene therapy. She knows more about those men than anyone else. You mean uh. you've seen them naked? <laughs> Make no mistake, I'm not a nurse. I'm a scientist. By the way, what was that injection for? It's a combination well, of nanomachines uh, and an anti-freezing peptide so that your blood and other bodily fluids don't freeze, even at sub-arctic temperatures. Nanomachines? Not just one kind, either. There are different types which will replenish the supply of adrenaline, nutrition, and sugar in your bloodstream. Well, it creates uh, now I don't have to food? worry about food. I also put some nootropics in there. What do I need Say to what? For? Nootropics. A class of drugs which will help improve your mental functioning. It'll make me smarter, huh? Anything else? Yes. Benzedrine. It's a type of stimulant. It'll keep you alert and responsive for 12 straight hours. That was quite a cocktail. Anything else in there? Coffee. Those nanomachines will also keep your codex batteries charged up. I guess I can call you when I'm ready to go on a diet. You're welcome. You should probably go on a diet. Hmm. I should probably make a reference uh, in the... In, in, I'll make a link in the description uh, saying where this... where a lot of my references are from. Alright, now for... Now we're in the home stretch. Chief of DARPA and the president of an arms manufacturing company. What business God, did they what, have what at a nuclear weapons sure disposal facility? These guys, like, the truth is faces. that secret exercises like, uh, were being conducted like when, at the time like the, the terrorist DARPA group attacked. Pissed, Must be extremely AT important exercises if those sad. two were directly involved. Were they testing some kind of new advanced weapon? I'm not privy to that information. Do we know exactly where they're being held? The DARPA chief has also been injected with a mini transmitter. Why? If you get closer, you should be able to pick up his location on your radar. Why did he have that? And wow, this picture is getting pixelated. In fact, I haven't... Actually, this also brings up. I haven't been keeping track of the timer. I want to see whether it's being consistent. Do they really have the ability to launch a nuclear missile? They say they do. They even gave us the serial number of the warhead they plan to use. Eight, six, seven, What's five, the number three, confirmed? Zero, nine. I'm afraid so. At the very least, they've got their hands on a real nuclear warhead. That's Isn't there some kind of safety device to prevent this type of terrorism? Yes. Every missile and warhead in our arsenal is equipped with a PAL, which uses a discrete detonation code. PAL. Permissive action link. Yeah, the safety it's, control it's system built into all game, nuclear weapon never... systems. But even so, Whoa. we can't rest easy. I Why not? This camera right up to because the DARPA chief knows the detonation code. But even if they have a nuclear warhead, it must have been removed from its missile. All the missiles on these disposal sites are supposed to be dismantled. It's not that easy to get your hands on an ICBM. Although that I used to be true. Quite easy but to, since uh, the end of the Cold War, you can get anything if you have enough weapon. money and the this right connections. Is quite and are willing to hoard around a the terrorist army. How well armed are these terrorists? I know there was an exercise going on at the time they revolted. They're heavily armed, I'm afraid. What about their battle yeah, experience? A... The six I'm members of Foxhound in charge are all hardened veterans. They're tough enough to eat nails and ask for seconds. I wouldn't expect <laughs> anything less from Foxhound. The others are next generation special forces. They're not your average grunts either. They can see up to six feet ahead of them. But then they can't see shit.